Hey there guys, what's going on? On today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can remove the FRP lock on a Samsung device or any Android for this matter. All we have to do is to go to safeunlocks.com on your browser. It can be in a computer, it can be in a smartphone, iPhone, whatever you want. If you have a browser and an internet connection, you will be able to do it. So you can see, I need to verify my account to unlock this device. So you might be wondering, how is this possible? I'm going to show you on this video. So first, again, go to safeunlocks.com. Now go to services and you will find right here the FRP unlock. So you can see there is this awesome app, unlock any Android device from Android FRP lock. You can see there is some data about this app, some information, reviews, there is everything if you want to check it out, but we're gonna make this video as short as possible. So we're gonna jump right into the process. First, we need to enter our name, then our email, and now we have to select the device model we want to unlock. So you can see there is a great variety of devices that you can unlock. If none of these brands, it's yours. You can choose the any Android model. It's gonna work anyway. But on this case, we're gonna use Samsung. Now we have to select IMEI, of course, because we need to verify or identify this device. And we need to enter that IMEI number right there. It's really simple to get, guys. If you go on the back of your device, you'll find some information. And as you can see right here, I got my IMEI number. If you don't have the IMEI number right there, there are two other choices that you can take. Either go to your box if you have it and you'll find your IMEI there. I'm positive you're gonna find it. And the other option that it's not universal is that on the SIM card tray, it is likely that you will find your IMEI number. We're gonna enter the IMEI number of this Samsung device we want to unlock. All right, guys, make sure all the information is correct. I just entered all the information required and all I have to do is to click on I accept the $1 fee to sign up and unlock my device and you have to click on the proceed button. Now, you just landed in the order ID page. Well, mine. and. Well, all I have to do is to get a membership ID. It says here, to finish your order, please watch the video below on how to continue. So we're gonna go to that and you see, need help? There is a really cool tutorial I'm gonna show it to you. Hey, it's Jacob from Safe Unlocks. Your order with us is almost ready. All right, as you can see, it's only a minute. It doesn't take long and we have to scroll up and we need to get that membership ID. So we're gonna click on I not robot, complete the captcha. And now we have to click on the continue to sign up button. Over here, you can see the sign up button and you know what to do. There is a full tutorial down below. It's only a minute. So we'll see each other in just one second. Okay guys, I am done completed my membership ID. It was a really simple process. And all we have to do now is to go to our email. Now over here in the inbox, we have to wait for that membership ID. So let's give it a minute. All right, guys, perfect. I can see the email by Safe Unlocks membership ID. Let's open it up. It says, hey, Nick, thank you for using Safe Unlocks. Your membership ID has been verified. Please use it on the order page to get it started. Over here, I have the ID. So we're gonna copy this exact ID and we're gonna go to the order. And over here where it says, enter here to continue, we're gonna paste it. And if you did everything correctly, you'll see the start order button. It is as simple as that. We're gonna press it. And as you can see, your order is now in progress. Now, you might be wondering what you have to do now. It is really simple. They're gonna send us some login details where we're gonna enter it on the FRP device to unlock it. So let's go back to the email and let's open the inbox over here and let's wait for that. Okay guys, perfect, FRP dummy ID. Let's open this email. Your FRP dummy ID was generated successfully. Please enter this ID on the device you have selected using the IMEI number. This dummy ID does not contain any type of personal data. We got an email and a password, so we're gonna tape of FRP lock device and we're gonna enter that same information that was sent on our email. So let's go ahead and do that. All right, I got the email and now let's enter the password. All right, let's make sure everything is correct. So you can see, same email, same password. And after that, we're gonna hit on the next button. 
All right, over here, we're gonna press on add previous account. And over here, don't copy. All right, account added. And all we have to do now is to hit next. Now, next over here, just say yes to this, accept. And over here, skip and skip anyway. You don't want to install any of these apps and hit on OK. And over here, sign up to your Samsung account. We're gonna skip this, skip and finish. All right, remind me later. And now we're on the home screen of this Android device. So all we have to do now, it's really simple. Go to settings and all you have to do now, scroll down accounts and backup, go to accounts. And over here, I can see the dummy account and we're gonna press remove account. Remove account. And that's all you have to do. It was really simple. So you can see this device is now fully unlocked from the FRP lock. If you want to do it yourself, remember, go to safeunlocks.com and you'll be able to do it in only a few minutes. And remember, you only need a browser and an internet connection. It is really simple. And we hope this video was really helpful for you. See you again on next video. Bye.